This is Joseph Barone, the CEO of A Fool for Learning, and the topic for today is based on a saying of Will Rogers, you only have one chance to make a good first impression. As some of you know, I belong to a networking group, and one of the hallmarks of the group, as with many other networking groups, is to invite individuals to join, especially if their business is not currently represented within the group. We invite you to join us for breakfast, see what a meeting is like, talk to some of the folks, and if interested, join. Not too long ago, I met with someone who was in a business that was not represented in our group. It was a good fit because this business would have easily obtained referrals from the loan officers, the insurance agents, and those within the construction trades within our networking group. I invited him to join us and he accepted. Of course, I informed our leadership team that he would join us. On the day of the meeting, he did not show. He wrote to me saying that he came to the location, tried to find us, but no one knew anything about us and left. Okay, I took him at his word. I apologized and invited him to the next meeting. A couple of days before the next meeting, I sent him an email with the exact location within the hotel where we meet and my cell phone number. I told him that if for any reason he could not find us, please call and I would come out and find him. He responded that he would be there and once again I informed the leadership team. The meeting starts and he is not there. I kept an eye out for him and ensured my cell phone was on. The meeting came to an end and still not there. To this day, I've received no phone call or email from him, nothing. This tells me so much about this person because in my opinion, he cannot be entrusted to keep his word. If he could not come, he could have easily sent me an email to that effect. I understand, things happen. But in addition, it is embarrassing as I was willing to vouch for him. Now, to be honest, I will never recommend him to anyone, and if anyone asks, I will not give him a positive review, as he did not keep his word. And if you cannot keep your word, then you cannot be trusted to do a good job. Remember, you only have one chance to make a good first impression. Don't blow it. This is Joseph Barone, the CEO of A Fool for Learning, signing out. Remember, Semper Gumby, Always be flexible.